Welcome back to my channel and as you can tell by the title, I will be trying on lipsticks that I got from the dollar store just to see how pigment they are. So if you're interested, stick to them. Okay, and so if you can see this little light thing in the back, this is not my backdrop, this is just a scarf that I hang in there and I just never moved. So these are the few lipsticks that I have from the dollar store right here. This one, I do have one wet and wild one. Um, it was 95 cents that I got from my local drugstore. Okay, so... So I don't have to keep telling you how much I paid for them. All the lipsticks were a dollar, and the wet and wild, the wet and wild lipstick was ninety five cents. So the first thing I got is when I'm just saying the when it's W I N. So I'm probably saying it wrong, but whatever. And it's a purple. It doesn't say the kind. It says twenty nine on it. So this is it. It's like a deep purple. You can see. Oops, sorry. Deep purple. If I put, I'm gonna swatch it here. So here's what it looks like. Put it on. And if I keep looking up, I'm looking at the mirror in front of me so I can see I can put it on okay. So you see that I put on a couple coats so that you know you can actually see it. So it's a pretty color. And I know this lipstick does not leave a lip chapped. It leaves them really moist. It's like putting on a color chapstick. Okay, so the next color I got is from the same wind, people. And this is 11. Okay, it looks like, look, I did not, this looks weird, sorry, but, but it's like an orange color, kind of. I guess I'm going to swatch it. So that's that right there. I'm going to try it on. So I, don't, I get afraid of colors like this, like they scare me. I'm just trying to go out of my comfort zone. So this one, I don't have to put that many coats on because it's so pigmented and it's so bright. So I'm going to put it on once. This. So this one, like I said, they all make my lips feel moist. Like, they don't feel chapped. They don't feel crazy. So I do like this one. I kind of like it. I just like... I have to wear it a couple times to get used to it, but I like it. Tell me how you like it. Okay, same company win. This is 33. And this is like a dark red. It looks lighter, but it's like a dark red. Oh, now that I'm swatching it, it looks like, like a cherry, like a cherry. Right here. Oh, this one too. I don't really have to. You don't really have to put a lot of coats up here. So far for me to get these from the dollar store, they work really good and I really like the light. So I think I'm going to go back and grab me some more of these lipsticks. They're really cute. So this is this. So comment right now. Let me know out of those three which ones you like the best. Because I'm really feeling all of them. So I have a few more left. The next one is the Wet and Wild one. Right here. This is called Dark Wine. Now she said I haven't opened this yet, so. And this was the 97 cents one. So 
That's right here. Yeah, that's really pretty. I like that one. This is dark wine. Okay, so I like wine a lot, but this feels a little greasy and oily, like compared to the dollar films I got, where like they made my lips feel really moist, like they didn't make it feel chapped. Okay, so the next lipstick that I got from Boston, I'm so nervous to try. This is ISN, I think. This is what it's called, ISN. And it's a poison ivy. Oh, that sounds good. 42. And it's a green. That's it. Okay, I'm nervous even more now because I thought that I thought that this green wouldn't be as pigment, like the color wouldn't be so bright, so I wouldn't have to worry. But the way this swatched, I'm kind of nervous. So let's try. <laughs> Sorry, my camera just died. So this is the green. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you do, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you. Leave a comment below and let me know what lipstick that you like the best. And once again, thanks for watching.